We just got back from grocery shopping for the week. I thought it'd be fun to show you everything that I bought at Costco and why I like it. Cause I've shown you guys all the good Whole30 and Keto things, but I want to tell you what my favorites are. So here is my haul for the week. I also got paper towels and toilet paper. <laughs> I have to go put them away. <laughs> So everything that I got is Whole30 compliant except for two things. So this string cheese obviously is not Whole30, but Sean loves it. He doesn't have dairy issues that we do, so I get in this organic string cheese. And then this salami, it is a great clean eating salami, but it does have dextrose in it, which is a sneaky word for sugar. But it's such a small amount, like keto-wise, it's like zero carbs. So I'm totally okay eating this when I'm not on a Whole30. The kids love it and Sean loves it. It's like no nitrates or anything. Fruit is great for Whole30, it's allowed, but it isn't the best for keto because fruit has more sugar in it. So I got, these are for the kids. So I got organic blueberries and organic grapes that the kids will snack on. I love these sausages. These are Whole30 and keto. It was hard to find a good keto sausage that was clean eating because so many of them are um, like apple. <laughs> they have apple in it. This one's great. So I'm gonna use this. We're gonna make a sheet pan, my sheet pan sausage and veggie dinner. So one night we'll have this for dinner and then I'll have the leftovers for lunch after. I got avocados. They're always like rock hard when you buy them at Costco, but I buy them every week because a week later they're perfect. This is my favorite olive oil. It's the organic extra virgin olive oil and I bought a ton of it because I'm going to make some pesto using some pesto that I got at the farmer's market. Also got a huge bag of lemons. I use lemons the most. I love, I use it for my homemade mayonnaise. I'll put it in my water. I love it in recipes to add acid. I got this uh, organic coconut milk, canned coconut milk that is Whole30 and great for keto. I've been using this the most in my creamy cashew coffee to add a lot of fat. I've been eating it iced, and so rather than using butter, I've been using coconut milk. So I've been going through a ton of this, and I love it. It doesn't work to make coconut whipped cream, though. It's too liquidy. I also got, so for veggies, I got some mushrooms organic mushrooms, organic asparagus, organic green beans. And then I got these little cucumbers because a lot of you were asking if my pickles will work with little cucumbers. So I'm gonna try it out for you guys and let you know. And last I got a bag of organic almonds. <laughs> this is the best price for raw almonds that I found anywhere. I've searched everywhere. So it's a great price. I use it to make my almond butter, my homemade almond milk, and just a snack on. You go through like a bag a week.